bluest eye is set in 1941, and much of it is narrated by a young African-American girl, Claudia McTeer, who lives with her parents and her older sister, Frida. In the introduction, another girl, Picola, comes to stay with the McTeers after her father, Charlie Breedlove, tried to burn down the Breedlove's home. In the rising action, while Piccola is staying with Claudia's family, she begins menstruating. Piccola wants to have blue eyes, believing if she had them, life would be better. At school, Piccola is teased by a classmate named Maureen Peel. Shortly thereafter, Piccola is mistreated by a neighborhood boy, Louis Jr., who abuses his cat in front of her, and when his mother returns home, he blames Piccola. The girls think Frida should drink alcohol to avoid being ruined, and decide to get some from Charlie. They find Piccola waiting outside the house where her mother works. They're challenged by a little white girl who lives there, and Piccola accidentally spills a pie her mother made. Mrs. Breedlove scolds Piccola harshly, but speaks kindly to the white girl. The next two chapters describe the histories of Mrs. Breedlove and Charlie. One morning, as he comes home drunk, Charlie sees Piccola standing in a pose that reminds him of Pauline. In the heart-wrenching climax of the bluest eye, Charlie tries to flirt with Piccola, and he rapes her. In the falling action, Piccola visits Soaphead Church, a fortune teller, and asks him to help her get blue eyes. Soaphead tricks Piccola into poisoning his landlady's elderly dog. Piccola runs away, eventually losing her mind. In the resolution, Claudia and Frida travel the neighborhood selling seeds. They overhear gossip in the neighborhood that Piccola is pregnant with Charlie's baby. They decide to bury their saved up money and seeds as an offering to protect Piccola's baby. They believe if the seeds grow, the baby will be fine, but the baby died.